hypoallergenic dog food. What's that? You might know there are tons of things that can cause allergic reactions for humans, from cosmetics, food, clothes, and even pets like dogs, but did you know that even dogs can have allergies? Now that's rough if we do say so. Never to fear though, smart pet owners are two paws ahead with hypoallergenic dog food, dog food that won't cause your pup to have an upset tummy. Curious about hypoallergenic dog food and want to know if your pup needs it? You're in the right place. We'll tell you all about this wonder food for dogs. But before that, if you like helpful, fun, and informative dog videos, give this video a thumbs up, subscribe, and click the bell button for more possum videos. Now, with that said, let's get started. Dogs and allergies. More often than you might imagine, dogs are affected by food allergies and sensitivities. Like people, dogs' immune systems begin to respond when they are exposed to allergens. For example, while most dogs love to eat chicken, others are allergic and will throw up when they eat it. Your dog's body frequently mounts an allergic response to one dietary ingredient, like a protein or complex carbohydrate, just like people. Although dogs adore proteins, some of the most common allergies are to beef, chicken, lamb, chicken eggs, soy, and wheat. Since it takes time for your dog's body to build these antibodies, Allergies and sensitivities frequently don't manifest until your pet is exposed to the substance for a considerable amount of time. What is hypoallergenic dog food? Hypoallergenic dog food is specially made dog food that doesn't cause reactions in sensitive dogs. It's made with special proteins that aren't recognized as harmful by your pup's immune system, reducing the risk to your dog of suffering an allergic reaction. Hypoallergenic dog food is generally higher quality than what you find in the grocery store, so it can provide plenty of benefits beyond just alleviating your pup's allergies. It can lower the risk of health issues, including obesity, ear infections, colitis, blocked anal glands, heart disease, digestive problems, itchy and dry skin, or dermatitis. How to know if your dog has allergies. Like people, there are clear signs if your dog may have allergies. Typical allergy symptoms in dogs include scratchy skin or digestive issues, including flatulence, diarrhea, or vomiting. On top of that, your pet might suffer weight loss and hyperactivity. Definitely not a recipe for a happy life for our furry friends. If your pet has an allergy reaction, you may notice itchy skin on your dog's ears, paws, or stomach. One of the worst reactions is urticaria, known as skin hives. Skin hives can appear anywhere between 6 and 24 hours after your dog eats something that could activate an immune response. They're visible on dogs with short hair, but you might need to feel for them on dogs with longer hair. Your pet becomes uncomfortable from these itchy places, which results in biting, scratching, hair loss, open sores, and sometimes infection. If your dog's paw or ear infection persists though, this may point to a food sensitivity rather than an allergy. When this happens, finding ways to assist your dog is the first thing on the list. That means a visit to your trusted vet to diagnose the issue and help put together the best diet plan for Fido. That's the important part. Once you identify the culprit behind your dog's allergic reaction, they need a hypoallergenic diet specific to them. This could mean providing a hypoallergenic diet for 8 to 12 weeks before gradually reintroducing their regular foods to see which one caused an allergic reaction. You may even need to forgo dog treats, table scraps, supplements, vitamins, and some medicines to eliminate every potential allergic trigger. Remember to always check with your veterinarian about your hypoallergenic food plan to make sure it won't cause more harm to your beautiful pet. Here are some things to consider for your furry friend's safety. Avoid feeding them meat that is raw or undercooked, which can result in salmonella or E. coli poisoning. Also foods such as raisins, grapes, garlic, onions, macadamia nuts, or foods containing xylitol products like sweetened peanut butter can be quite bad for dogs. So, what foods should you incorporate into your dog's hypoallergenic diet? A high-quality, homemade dog food recipe that is nutritionally complete calls for vitamins and minerals, including B vitamins, calcium, iron, vital fatty acids, and zinc should be included in these recipes. You also might want to try feeding your dog alternative proteins, such as lamb, salmon, pork, or bison. While it might sound ideal to only feed your dog its nutrients in the form of whole foods, you should add concentrated supplements to fill in the nutritional gaps. 
Check the link in the description for a few ideas of great foods you can try at home. Now that you know more about hypoallergenic foods for your dog, you can now prepare your hypoallergenic dog food to keep your pet happy and healthy. Our tails are definitely wagging at that thought. We bet your dogs will too. Thanks so much for watching. Got a great doggy recipe you want to share? Let us know in the comments. Tune in next time for more great doggy content. See you soon.